So I did the Arkham Asylum Platinum a little bit over a month ago. And I said in that video that I'll be doing all four Arkham game Platinums. I want to Platinum all Batman Arkham games. Arkham Asylum, Arkham City, Arkham Origins and Arkham Knight. Which brings us to this video. Arkham City. Now this is a bit of a side note. Normally I don't show many, if any, of my rages. But you guys always say, show us the rages. So I've kept all of them in for this video. If you know this game, then you know when to expect the rages. However, despite what I said in my Arkham Asylum video, I won't be doing all four Arkham games. With Arkham Asylum done, leaving me with Arkham City, Arkham Origins and Arkham Knight, sadly we have to eliminate Arkham Origins as the Platinum is now unobtainable as literally two months ago, the online servers died. Some people are even reporting that it was working up until about three to four weeks ago. So we'll be skipping Origins and going straight from this video, Arkham City, straight to Arkham Knight. And hopefully one day we'll be streaming the Origins game just to get all the single player trophies. Without further ado, let's jump into it. So here we are boys, Batman Arkham City. Game I have never played, unlike Arkham Asylum where I played and completed it back in the day just didn't get the Platinum. Arkham City is a game I have never ever played. I'm generally excited to get into this one. It's been about a month since I played Arkham Asylum, so I got used to the controls again, but I am looking forward to this. So Arkham City isn't Gotham? Because those inmates earlier were like, Batman won't be here in Arkham City. Huh! I don't think so, buddy. Oof. Well, that's sick. Oh, I broke free. Nice, combat still feels good. Feels smoother than um, Asylum. Suit up, nice. Here we go. I'm, I'm Batman. Become the bat. Sick. Oh. 480. Cool. Let's do this. I thought it was a different suit in this game. I didn't think it was the same one from Asylum. I don't mind. I think it's a sick suit, but... I thought it was all black in this game for some reason. Thinks you're telling the truth. Batarang. No, okay, that would have been cool though, you can't lie. Should you just throw a chair at me? Objection. Ah! <laughs> I was gonna say, that was supposed to happen. Isn't his armor bulletproof though? Acid bath. Save the damsel, but is she in distress? Apparently there's a missable here. I read that there's a missable somewhere. Still in there? I think so. I can hear someone in there. Keep that door shut, man. I don't want to go head to head with Batman. You didn't say it was Batman. Why the hell are we still here? Is it this guy? Or something? You think? I can don't throw a batarang at him. Keep that door. Oh, here we go. Remote control batarang. There we go. Catch. Find someone to play remote Batarang catch with, yeah. Hello, oh, hello, Harley. <laughs> Let the lady go, bat freak. Or you'll all get a bullet. Just stay there and this will all end. Drop a smoke pellet. Boom! They don't know where I am. Good. Let's keep it that way. Time to survey the room. Plan out my tactics. Four thugs, all armed, two hostages. This is gonna be easy. This is some pretty dope Batman dialogue, I'm not gonna lie. From anywhere. Stay calm. Double takedown. Boom! Come here. Sick takedown. <laughs> Perfect landing there. Ah. Saviour, save the medical volunteers. Are oh, you welcome, guys? I want you to think you're sick. Then wham, gotcha. I don't know, man. Chimney sweep. There is only one way in. What's wrong with you, G-Man? You come into Mr. J's home and start smashing into pieces. Oh! 
Oh my god, that, that made me jump. Holy crap. Why did that make me jump so much? I was expecting to see Harley. Easiest week of making me jump, you punk. One armed bandit, hammer the point home. Nice. So, of course, as always, I carried on with the story, but I ended up doing a lot of the side missions along the way, mostly because they were on the way, but also because they're relatively intriguing. Like, for example, a random phone ringing. I generally wanted to know what that was, as well as some of the riddles. Of course, there's no way I was going to do all the riddles in like my first run through of like during the story because. There's so much to do, but each of the story missions were generally fun, nothing felt too dragged out, boss battles were unique and far and few between which is nice, I, I'm not a fan of games where there's like 180 boss battles because they all kind of become a bit mute to one another, so this was actually a really well paced game, the same as Arkham Asylum actually, that's one thing I've found in common between the two games, they're both really really well paced, the story moves along nicely, and again same as Arkham Asylum, it all takes place in one night, except for this moment here where these wet fart punches Probably one of the most <laughs> anticlimactic beatdowns ever. You think it's going to be these big heavy punches and they sound kind of like wet farts. But I carried on with the story, as I said, and working on some side missions. Really enjoyed the story. I don't have any negatives to say about the story. I didn't feel like it dragged too much. It just, yeah, it was just really, really good fun, really well paced. If you've played it, then you know what I'm talking about. I think we're nearing the end of the game. Uh, I think we're now about to have some kind of showdown with Joker. I have generally really enjoyed this game. Sometimes I feel like Batman is a bit slow to navigate around the city, but when you get like a nice flow of grappling and gliding going, then it's really not too much of an issue. All in all, I have, uh, I've really enjoyed myself with the game. Batman has been through it. If you guys have played the game, then you know that Batman has absolutely been through it this evening. Oh! I feel like that's not Joker. It never normally is Joker when something like this happens. It's going to be a fake or Clayface. I think he can change people. Oh, was I right? Oh, damn, I was right. That's Clayface. So I've got to throw a bunch of these at him. Freeze blast. Huh, 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 huh. <laughs> Combo throw. Oosh, oosh. Ow, okay, yeah, that hurt. Oh, have we done it? I think we've done it. That was close. I was 100% one shot away from dying. Let's grab that cure out of his mouth. Oh my god. You could have just reached your hand. And in, surely? Did you need to jump down his throat? Could have just reached your hand in and pulled it out, but instead Batman was like, I'm going to swan dive into his mouth. Exit stage right. All the world is a stage. He, t I mean, it took a lot to kill him, and it wasn't really even us. I mean, we caught him with a corker of a right hook in Arkham Asylum, an explosive gel right hook. Uh, and even that didn't put him away. Well, this has been a really fun story, man. The game is, The game is really good. Um, the story's really engaging. The uh, dialogue is is solid. All, all the voice actors are pretty decent as well. New game plus unlock. Take on the story mode again, but this time armed with every gadget. I'm not going to do that. I am going to do uh, what's it called? I'm going to carry on with the save that I'm on right now and do all the side missions and stuff. And then I've got to do the Riddler stuff, which I know there's a lot. It's just like looking around the map, I know there's a lot to do. I have been trying to collect as many as possible. Now this is where the bulk of the trophies came from as well as the bulk of the fun and this was all of the side missions. 
again really enjoyable really well paced a bit one of the things that i really liked was with bane where it seemed like you're going to have a battle but you just locked him behind a gate in a cutscene, which is really fun they didn't feel the need to force an unnecessary boss battle same with zar same with the riddler they they didn't be like all right now it's got to be an, an 80 stage boss battle it just worked really well of course i had to carry on with the riddles which it's probably one of the worst things of this game, collecting those 400 odd riddles that you need, or 440 or whatever it is. It's absolutely ridiculous the amount that you need to collect. I didn't mind the, the missions of saving the hostages, but it was going around and collecting, solving all of the puzzles. But I did break it up, as you can see there. Sometimes I'm saving a couple of a couple of hostages, and then you'll see I'm doing a few things like stopping dead shot, which was fun. And then I carried on with the riddles again. But <laughs> they were brutal. And after all this time of playing, I finally got a 50 combo, which just shows that I really didn't find my flow with the combat until maybe hour 40, quite possibly. It was ridiculous. But to be honest, this side mission stuff actually doesn't take that long. I'd say the story's like... 10 to 15 hours if you watch all cutscenes side missions are probably 10 hours at most you you, you do have a lot of the a lot of the playtime during the next stage of this platinum which is the 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 riddler stage which is absolutely the riddler's revenge which is just brutal oh my god guys it's over it's done the collectibles done so this is where we're at at the minute main stories 100% side missions 100% upgrades and collectibles 100% it does say i don't have all of the concept arts that I have 79 of 80, but I don't think that matters. I think it's just the Riddler's secrets you need as well as the Wayne Tech upgrades. But now the next part is the Riddler's Revenge, the ranked and campaign medals, 72 and 108. This is what is next. This is apparently what is the hardest part of the whole game. All right, let's just give one combat one a go, one stealth one a go, and let's just see kind of how I feel. Because I have not been feeling as like, on Arkham Asylum, I felt okay. I felt like kind of slick in Arkham Asylum. So in seconds of trying, the dog the dog barked because the door went. So I'm gonna see if I can pick up where I left off. Okay, that wasn't very good. That was pretty terrible actually. I could have got some finishes in there. I could have done some other moves. Oof. Bring it on. Okay, that was. Uh, uh. Let's. Ju I'm just gonna. My curiosity is just to see how many. Oh, that's terrible. Like, I just want to see how many rounds there are, like I did with... Ah! Oh! Yeah, I'm doing terrible, bro. Holy crap. That was a really good round as well. I messed it up at the end. That's a damn shame. So, 18,000. Christ, that was... Alright, yeah, it's just going to take getting into that flow, man. That was the first one. I want to try the first stealth one as well. Some, some kind of smoke. Alright, that actually worked. What else have we got? Knock down a henchman with a batarang and finish him with the ground. I can do that at the end. Shoot a henchman with an RC... Oh, AC gadget. There we go. Get... Whoa! Nearly actually shot me. And there we go took me four minutes so not the best time but i have no interest in having like a crazy good time but we got all three stealth is stealth is my realm that is where i i really do exceed i, I am pretty good at it um so yeah these are the rank challenges i got a feeling these are gonna make me a little bit mad but i'm gonna start with them i'm gonna start with them i'm gonna just work in and just try my best and then you've got campaign medals Okay, so there's 120 of them, and that goes stealth, fighting, stealth. Fighting, stealth, fighting. Oh, damn. Okay.
No way! I completely screwed there, guys. I pressed R2 and triangle, and he just done a little like. Uh, S Batman, you screw, you screwed me, you. F How is that fair? How is that fair? He was in jumping distance. He was there. Oh. The fact that I'm getting annoyed on the first one is, is not boding well for me, guys. Don't think I got it again. I think I was a f nat nut away. Sick. Good start. Really good start there. Yep, I threw a punch and no one was there. Awesome. The invisible man appeared, apparently. <laughs> yeah. Okay, then. Sure. Yep. Damn. Messed up big time at the end there. Oh, we did it! Oh! What a result! Absolutely smashed it. And now, I am happy. <laughs> so I finally ended up getting into a flow with the combat challenges and actually being able to beat the first one, which is just so embarrassing it took me that long. But I was able to beat a few of them and get the 24 medals. Uh, once you do get into the flow, you, it, it's not too bad. I mean, this score you can see here, you need the 48,000. And here I'm on 75,000 because I just... When you find a fly man, it really is not that difficult, which I never thought I would say. But then again, I do end up eating my words later in this video, which you will see. But you can see there again, uh, got another three medals and got the trophy for the silver rank that you'll see will pop in a moment. So these, these between bronze and silver, five hours or so. On home. Right, right. Oh, that's not good. Right, right. Oh, God. Oh, hold on back. So as you can see, I'm on 69 of the needed 72 for these ranked map trophies. Honestly, these weren't as bad as I thought the combat ones. The first one I really struggled on, and then... Funhouse Brawl, I found a nightmare. The extreme ones are really easy because you can mess up multiple times. There's so many enemies. I, I didn't really struggle too much with them, but definitely got some rages at me with the Funhouse Brawl. And then the stealth ones. Uh, these have been a little bit annoying, but some of them actually haven't been too bad. And we're now onto the final one, Top of the World Extreme. And then we can go on to the Campaign Medals, I think they're called. Damn it. I don't know what I could have done there. I don't know what I was doing wrong. I swear to God, you can sneak, take down that guy. It's the only one I've, I've like, kind of felt clueless about. Contact. Enemy device found. Huh? Oh my God! Are you kidding me? Why can't I drop a, a smoke? What the f- Oh, for f sake, this is doing my head in. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? There we go. That was stressful. <laughs> Gold Revenge. Obtain all 72 medals uh, uh, on the Origin Arkham City. Oh, Origin. Original Arkham City ranked maps as Batman. So after getting the ranked gold, it was then onto the campaigns. Now, the campaigns really confused me at first. I didn't realise that you actually had to get all of the medals as well as, like, doing everything else. As well as having the, the negative and the positive modifiers. So this was relatively challenging. At times, really, really easy. I was kind of zooming through. But some of them, as you will see in a bit, just stumped me just completely and utterly stumped me it's very nerve-wracking when you get to like the third stage of each of these it can be pretty tough and i got the perfect free flow there all right guys so here we are with the campaigns we have done uh 10 of them we have two more to go combat master and predator master honestly not been too bad 
uh, pulled a couple of rages out of me, but other than that, these have been uh, somewhat easier than the ranked medals, in my opinion. Obviously, sometimes it is a pain, like, having to pick such brutal negatives against you but it's not been too bad but these are now the toughest ones there's gonna be three combat in a row and three predators in a row uh i've been feeling all right with the, the combats to be honest now that i kind of have have the flow to it honestly not been too bad other than that these have been uh somewhat easier not been too bad uh, somewhat easier but somewhat easier Mm. What the f That's just glitched on the stairs. Hello, can you f work head controller for Damn, smash the second round and f the third. Look how bad I messed up the third. That's tough. I gotta do them all again. I should have just restart. Why didn't I restart? I knew I was gonna cock it up. Oh, for f sake. That's f off now. F hell, you. F I've done it. Lovely. Now all I gotta do is just, just get through these, these ladies. Let's go, boys. We did it. We had some rage. We had some zen moments, <laughs> but we got through it. Yeah. Originally, you know what, guys? Leading up to the medals, I thought Arkham City's Platinum is easy. That was going to be the title. Then after I done the rank, it was like Arkham City's Platinum is pretty tough. But now I'm thinking Arkham City's Platinum is fucking brutal. <laughs> so now to the final one. I had like 10 minutes away just to have a breather because <laughs> that stressed me out. But now to the final one, which is Predator Master. Um, stealth is kind of my, my realm. I'm pretty comfortable with, with the stealth in this game. I find it a lot easier than the combat. I read that everyone failed the found the predator hard on the combat i disagree but it's definitely each of their own but i personally really enjoy um the stealth you, went this way. you su i went to disable his gun why did i jump out like that holy sh well, well. idiot Dude, this f game is a f sh what the f man. What the f dude? Well, well. Honestly, I'm 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 gonna do I'm gonna try this run and then I'm just gonna have to take a break because if not I'm gonna snap my monitor in half. Why did not? Why did it not hit him? How utterly, utterly. Batman, please, please just stop climbing things. Alright, come on. Come on, get up here. Come on. Come on, get up here. Get up here, you little turds. Get up here. Get up here, get up here. Get up here. Yeah, your gun, your gun is bugging, mate. Have some of this. And we should get a free medal. Yes. Fuck um. you. I finally understand why this platinum is considered brutal. Holy <laughs> That was difficult. <sighs> Dude, I need a nap. So after the campaign gold, I just need to do two relatively easy trophies, which is a no damage combat run, which I just stuck on the first map and took my time. Really easy, as well as the calendar man trophy, which in which is a bit of actually, actually a bit of a nightmare, believe it or not. You have to set your date to 2021 for it to work. Super random, but all in all, not too bad. And then after that, I started a new game plus.
Alright guys, we're coming to the end of New Game Plus. I've still got a lot of side missions to do for the Perfect Night Trophy, I believe, but this is the main story. Should be done here. I just need to beat Clayface. There we go. Wow, first time. I was a little bit stressed about that. My heart is racing. <laughs> I didn't know how difficult it was going to be. Come here, you. There we go. And there we go. Twice nightly. Complete new game plus. Alright, so we're on 97%. Uh, 100% uh, of the main story on uh, new game plus done. And you can see the side missions there. A few of them we actually done. Five of them we done 100%. So, still got a few more to do. But hopefully it'll only take me a few hours. So, I'm going to crack on with that. And I'll see you guys when I'm right near the end. Okay, guys. It's time to get this platinum. 99%. And all I need to do... Oh, good start. Is talk to the mysterious watcher who is down here. Or the symbols right there, should I say. Is this it? Is this my trophy, please? Oh my god, we've done it. Complete every challenge in Arkham City. Main story, side missions, upgrades, collectibles, new game plus, and Riddler's Revenge as Batman. And... The Platinum Trophy, congratulations. You're damn right, congratulations. I'm going to clear the air quickly with the DLC. I will be doing it in the future in a stream. I want to start streaming next year. So I'm going to be doing all DLCs from games that I've platinumed over the year. And I'm going to be doing them all in streams next year. Hopefully, I'll be, I'll be able to start streaming in, in the first few months. Just to clear the air for those wondering why I haven't done the DLC in this video. Platinum 148, and according to my PlayStation, it took me 68 hours. Not too long in terms of time frame, it took me a week. And two hours, I could have done it quicker. There was a lot of times where I walked away for just like two, three hours at a time just to have a breathe. I could have quit off the game and had my playtime go down. I'm really not that bothered. Playtime is playtime, who cares? And despite the stress and the rage, all things considered, I really did enjoy my experience with the game. I definitely recommend at least playing it if you guys haven't. But as always, I hope you guys did enjoy. I'm going to do a couple of other games before I do the next Arkham game, just to kind of break up the channel a little bit. And then I've got a few other series that I want to do, like Metro, Borderlands, and a few others that I'm working on. So yeah, thank you as always for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.